hear me. Is that your new tape? Star-Lord? Who's the guy with the scary eyes? He doesn't have a name. He's one of the space riders. And he's not scary. He's cool. Your space rider certainly got his hands full. Pretty far out! Nobody says far out anymore, Ma. <laughs> Ma! What? Nobody says far out anymore. Oh, well, your mom does. Maybe we should see if we could get tickets to see them live. Really? Mm hmm Your mom may not look it, but I was quite the rocker when I was your age. Your father and I would just lie on the hood of my old Chevy and listen to Black Sabbath and... You like Black Sabbath? Like I said, your mom's cooler than you think. Oh, we'd look up at the stars and he'd... Tell me all about the places he'd been. Mom? How about some cake, huh? Yeah, I'll be up in a sec. You said that 15 minutes ago. If you don't hurry, I'm gonna eat that whole cake myself. No, you wouldn't. Yes, I would. <laughs> you wouldn't. Yes, I would. Hey, watch the hair. <laughs> We've talked about you leaving your toys on the floor. It's not a toy. It's an action figure. More like an action landmine. Stab your foot. I will. He doesn't even... Never mind. Thirteen whole years. Look at you. Where does time go? I'll be up in a sec. I promise. Right. Oh man, I can't wait to play this. Maybe I can convince Annie to buy it with his paper out money. Oh man, traveling through space must be amazing. The final battle was awesome. Looked like the heroes were done for, but they pulled it off. This will be worth hundreds of dollars someday. to beat Janie's high score. This is embarrassing. Three natural ones in a row last game. Some barn I turned out to be. It's pretty crazy that all that destruction started from one little mistake. Need to build up my calluses. We'll make our stand. Keep hitting those dingers, George. You'll make it in the Hall of Fame for sure. Fingers are still crap from trying to bookmark pages. I know it's not how you're supposed to play, but I'm tired of dying everywhere. We'll make our stand. Might as well just peel the stickers off and put them in the right spot. Love to be able to ride one of those light cycles. Ooh. Can't believe I caught this. That maiden show was awesome. Stop doing this, man. It's weird. We are approaching the quarantine zone. 
How long was I out for? 15,338 ticks. That's... very specific. The betrayer is ready to begin her mission. She has requested your presence in the cockpit. Gamora's on our side, Drax. She is the spawn of my sworn enemy, a murderess and a traitor. I do not trust her. We'll try. We're supposed to be a team. I make no promises. Oh, it ain't just a junkyard. The quarantine zone's the biggest pile of galactic war debris in the known universe. Just think of all the tech we can find. Hey, it's only illegal if Novacore finds us inside, which they won't. Roots right to be nervous, Rocket. Don't underestimate the Novacore. Oh, come on. Am I the only one who ain't scared of the galactic police? They've got the numbers on us. But they ain't got the brains. Ha! Sure takes a genius to catch my ship. My ship? Who said that? Well... No, I think I heard him. Ah, never mind. Ah, there you are, Quill. Tell Groot to stop worrying about getting arrested. I am Groot. I'm not overconfident. I'm just the right level of confident. <laughs> arrested? For what? <laughs> our ship just accidentally slipped into the quarantine zone. Oops, our navigation malfunctioned. Oops. <laughs> How would we accidentally cross into the Novacore force field? Details! <laughs> oh yeah, you remember that dealer who asked about the emitters? After you left, he... <laughs> he leans over me and he says, uh, w w what do you need these for, then? <laughs> yeah, like I'm turning the Milano into a dance club or something. Please refrain from creating this club of dance. Yeah, yeah, we all know how you feel about dancing. <laughs> well, what was I supposed to tell him? Uh, you know, I uh, need them to build uh, some ultrasonic lures so my team of ex-cons can trap a mystery creature in the most uh, legal place in the quadrant. You want to throw in a discount? Not so sure about tooth cleaning tablets. Manual brushing is where it's at. Hmm. This moment of quiet reminds me of the legendary siege of Seknoff 7. Oh, not again. It is said that Lady Hellbender held her breath through ten moons while riding across the stars on the back of a great horned beast. And when she when arrived... When she arrived, she exhaled, and the wind blew away the Shatari. Indeed, it did. If you realize the Drax! <clears throat> About Gamora. Can this not wait, Peter Quill? I am readying my body for battle. Uh, 
You know we're supposed to capture this monster, right? Not kill it? Of course. But I suspect it will not go down without a fight. Cool it, muscles. Lady Hellbender ain't gonna buy damaged goods. I will aim to preserve the integrity of the beast as best I can. Good. Morgoth, be with you. Hey, Morgoth yourself. I am cool. Morgoth is gonna like this thing. Catathian customs don't make no sense to me, bud. Good old Milano. Engine parts from at least five different black markets. All good, buddy? I'm Groot. You know, I don't understand you, Groot, but I'm gonna assume you just said something super kind and thoughtful. <laughs> I'm Groot. What did the tree say? No idea. Gizmo's rocket. I'm calling them thumpers on account of the noise they make. Assuming we get past the force field and reach your coordinates in one piece, all we gotta do is set them up, and these babies are gonna draw out our monster in no time. <laughs> How's that even gonna work? The thumper goes beep, 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 and the monsters come running? Eh, it goes more like, uh, wah! Ruckus at once! <laughs> and then the monster comes a running out of its hole. Are you sure about that? Hey, all my intel came from your source. My sources are very reliable. Those coordinates are 100% pointing towards a rare, elusive, priceless creature. With no physical description to go by. What do you think elusive means? No matter what the monster looks like. As long as it's got ears, you can be sure my thumpers are gonna drive it right into our arms. Gamora? Up here, Peter. Hey, that's my chair. Oh, then why aren't you in it? I was, uh, strategizing. It's one thing to get into the zone, but we still gotta catch that monster. Right. So did I miss anything? Other than a ton of suspicious glares from Drax, not really. Now, if you're done uh, strategizing, feel free to grab your seat. We're almost ready to go. Okay, here we go. Rocket Groot Drax, get in here. We're going in. We still have a few ticks before the next time window, actually. The next one? Nova Corps security gear resets every rotation. We want to be in and out before our code expires, or we'll get stranded. And if we wait for the next reset, we'll get a full rotation to do this. Nice. <laughs> oh, why is the Nova net still up? Thought we were going in. It appears the Assassin's contacts are as untrustworthy as the Betrayer herself. Oh, please don't tell me Gamora's backdoor codes are bust. We nearly went broke getting them. Relax, Rocket. We still got a few ticks before the next time window. The network just reset. You can enter the sequence, Peter. 0451. That's it? Four digits? Suspicious. These security measures are too simplistic for Novacor. It's not that simple. The code only works on this date for this ship. Oh, I get it. Gamora's codes are more like an encryption key. There. There 
there's so much stuff left after the war. Restraint wasn't very popular in the Shatari army, especially with Thanos in charge. Yeah, it's probably all harmless now. I mean, Novacor had 12 years to get rid of the heavy-duty explosives, right? <laughs> That's why I like you, Quill. You're so pure. Oh, the wonderful and terrible things I could do with all this tech. Stay focused, Rodent. We do not come here to scavenge. Why not? The Milano's weapon systems could use an overhaul. Plus, there's good money in it. The piece that we seek is far more valuable to the monster queen of Seknoth 9 than any illegally acquired salvage. Whoa! Oh, place is really shifty. I'm not seeing a monster, but that big cylinder up ahead looks like the mining ship Peter's friend said to look for. <clears throat> friend? For a night? And you'll see the monster as soon as we place Rocket's monster summoning thingies. Flark, yeah. Group Quill Suda. Team Rocket's up first. I still do not understand why I must remain on board with the assassin. Ugh, because you're part of Green Team. You assigned me to the team before you named it. My skin is not green, it's teal. Teal? Listen, if we want to trick the monster into going inside that mining rig, we need to place thumpers on both sides. Two sides, two teams. And two clicks to the drop site. Ground's too unstable to land a ship, so you'll need to jump. That's our cue. Let's go, group. <laughs> Don't worry! Once the thumpers are placed, we'll meet in the middle, and we'll capture the monster. Together. Very well. My baby. It's a ship, Peter, not a child. Oh! Oh! Can you imagine? I am Groot. What? The pink goo? It's custom nano resin, designed to keep all this war stuff from floating away. You find something we could sell? Nah, just some old correspondence. It's totally safe. Now, can we please focus less on the toxic goo and more on all this cool war junk it's holding together? Uh, okay. Guess we take- Oh! You okay, Quill? Yeah, I think so. This, uh, big resin stuff's definitely strong enough to hold this place together. Oh, yeah, yeah, yeah. Definitely, probably strong enough. Yep. Being here definitely feels a little weird. Yo, Quill! These coordinates are so reliable. How come we're the only ones out here trying to catch this thing? We're the only ones crazy enough! Settle an argument, Rodent. What is this omnipresent pink substance made of? You mean the Ebrium-based nano-resin cluster foam? Never trust something without many dashes in its name. I'm thinking that big cylinder thing is our rendezvous? Yeah, that's the mining rig. So weird seeing it all clustered together like this. Bits and pieces of a war that spanned the entire galaxy held together by... pink goo. Ebrium-based nano-resin. Whatever. I'm just saying, it's a lot to take in. I heard Novacor once wanted to cover entire planets in Novanet. You know, I think I do sort of get it. Thousands of worlds fighting for some fleeting greater good. Oh, look! Yellow and blue. Looks like an old Novacor freak. Nice! Come on, dude. People probably died on that ship. Killjoy, why do you even bring us here if the place is so sacred? <laughs> I can name at least a dozen planets with monsters on them, so why here? Flat broke, Rocket. We need a big break. Aren't you tired of eating Yarrow Root? It's so... mealy. Listen, this is a restricted zone. Whatever monster lives here, nobody else has one. Lady Hellbender values rarity in her acquisitions. Exactly. 
I am Groot. I told you, we ain't gonna get caught. Whoa! Okay. I'm okay. Ha! <laughs> Almost made yourself a very late war casualty. Not funny. You know, I like this. This is fun. I'm Groot. The three of us, hanging out, just like when we started this gig. Before you know who joined us. I am Groot. I do not hate everybody. I tolerate Quill. Come on, Rocket. Drax and Gamora are valued additions to the team. You're only saying that because she's listening. Is that why your plan has Drax and I taking the ship? Maybe. Hey, can't a guy want to spend some quality time with his friends? Pretty sure that way's a dead end. Eh, uh, you sure? Ah, there we go. Path's this way. Come on. How can you even tell? Just trust me, all right? Hey, Groot, you think we can find pieces of the Trion Shard in here? I'm Groot. You never heard of the Trion Shard? Pyramid of pure evil that corrupts everything it comes in contact with. I'm Groot. Making things up. Name one time I ever made something up. I'm Groot. I'm Groot. <laughs> ah, shut up. Ask Gamora. Bet she's heard about the Tryon chart. Hey, Gamora! I don't know what you're talking about. Oh, come on. I know Thanos had his hands on it during the war. How'd you even know the other way was a dead end? Because, unlike you, I have a very keen sense of direction. I am yeah, I'm sure it's safe-ish. Safer than flying with Kimura, anyway. I heard that. How many of these ships did you personally destroy? Oh, uh, watch it, Will! Uh, oh. <laughs> All good, no worries. But watch your step, guys. This junk isn't as stable as we think. Take that, brittle stuff! Ugh, I hate these ship-eating parasites. <laughs> Gross. <laughs> nice splatter. Hey, 50 units says I can clear more of these suckers than you. As if.